I am the oldest of nine kids. About 10 of us are in a house, grew up in this neighborhood, South Minneapolis. I came to this country when I was younger. Uh, my parents flew from a war zone. Yeah, last four days, past four days, it was horrible. The fire when I saw it two nights ago, it was just, it was a trick. It was like a trauma that was just like tricked again for me, you know? And I put that away in my life long, long time ago. And right away I told my mom, it's just, this is a war zone. This feels just like a war zone right now. Me and my sisters and my brother and my mom have been out in our business for the past four nights asking people, this is black owned business, please don't destroy this, this is a minority business, please don't do this to us. We all saw what happened to George. We all saw what happened to that man. It was injustice. All of this could be avoided, you know? That angers people, that angers people. We are in a COVID-19, we're in a pandemic. This shouldn't be a way for us to come back to our community when we were already suffering. The people that are protesting are doing it fine. 38th in Chicago is completely peace. For me, it's like that is the real protest. We're outshining everything else that should be focused on the media. We're talking about black, black people looting. We're talking about black people destroying their community. That's not really what's happening. Then there is a lot of young boys or men from out of town because you can see their plate numbers, you can see the way their approach, the way they're taught, their accents. They're not from here. They're not from here. And they're really geared up to break and destroy things. They're not for the cause. They're not here for the cause. You have to talk to the human heart for people to understand what is going on. You have to talk to the human heart to let them know that this is painful. This is not a way to get justice. For you to come out, if you want to stand by us and you want to fight with us justice, do it in a matter way, a way that people can understand, a way people can feel your pain. Tell your story, speak up.